Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new to my channel, thank you for watching. If you're an oldie moldy, welcome back. I have done this video three times, but luckily I didn't open anything. So we're going to do a very large toy haul. Lots of toys. Everything that I've ever wanted and been looking for for the past couple weeks, months, maybe per se. So I am drinking an ice called Dr. Pepper. My sister's ice machine broke and I have not had a Dr. Pepper in a week. In a week! And it's ice cold, it's refreshing, it's delicious. I missed it so much. Somebody's been playing on my desk, so I had to fix something. So, I'm at my parents' house. Yay! I'm in my toy room. Yay! I don't think I have to go back until Wednesday, knocking on wood. Do I have any wood? Yes, I do. And I found some Holy Grail stuff. Things that I was looking for, but like not hunting high and low. Just like low-key looking like, let's see if they have it. If they do, they do. If they don't, they don't actually did not get one of the rainbow high dolls that i wanted because i decided to get two other dolls that i was just like need to have these these are amazing i love them so much so super excited to find the barbie extra mini minis so stinking cute she's the one that was on my radar if i would have searched a little bit more at walmart i probably could have found the other ones but eh, didn't really care to i was just like i'm gonna grab her and I don't feel like searching. So she's amazing. She has peace sign earrings, a little alien get up. She's so stinking cute. Then I got this like kawaii esque looking uh, fashion pack. It's got ice creams and strawberries and a beautiful pink bag. And I was so in love with this set because I think it has like an ice cream chain necklace and a headband and all sorts of really fun cute stuff this is adorable i love this this is so cute and the shoes are really cute too i don't know if any of my dolls will fit the shoes or the glasses maybe they will maybe they won't i don't know i've been looking for this for a while now this is the my life as art supply playset. super excited for this because i want to set up a little um tablescape with this like they're doing an art project i thought that'd be so fun and i love it i don't know what's in here but it's a canvas, a sketchbook, drawings, paints, brushes, glue bottle, a paint palette, pair of scissors, pencils, markers, glitter shakers, and an art bin. So I guess this is the art bin. But I'm excited for this. And then I know that I keep saying that I don't like Monster High. I don't like the Monster High of 10 years ago. That just wasn't cute. This is so kawaii and so fun. I've been low-key looking for Draculaura just like in the you know in the doll aisle i see some monster high i don't see her so let's walk on finally found her at the walmart love her so so much she is like the kawaii queen she's like pastel goth i don't know i just love her her shoes are amazing her pet is amazing i know the hair is going to be craptastic i'm okay with that i also know that when i buy rainbow high dolls I expect to have their hair half gone in the back you know so I buy these dolls knowing that they're imperfectly perfect, if you know what I mean. Like, I know this doll is perfect to me, but it's also imperfect in the fact that the hair is really quite craptastic. It's greasy. It's not fun. I'm going to have to wash it. So, yeah, I love her body type. She's a little thicker, which is awesome. I love the artwork. Monster High. Monster High. So amazing. They had all of them. I just wanted her... And yeah, super excited for that. Then, oh my gosh, I'm going to have to pause this to get everything out of these bags. So you guys know I talk a lot. I had to go over the hill and far away to another land and get these. It was a 20-minute ride. And you know me, I don't do 20-minute rides to stores. I can always wait on Rainbow High Dolls. Always. I can always wait and you know, see them in stores and pick them up or order them online. I didn't want to order these girls online. I just did not want to. I wanted to see what they look like in person. And I wanted to look at them and really see them up close and personal. I did not want to order them online. This was the first doll that I actually ever really hunted for. I've hunted for dolls before, but this was the one where I was like, I'm not going to be satisfied to order these online. I want to see them up close and personal. So, I got Illy, 
Princess Jasmine inspired. These are the Disney bounding dolls. These are the Disney bounding dolls. And I will be opening these up in a video because, oh my gosh, so, so stunning. So, so stunning. I'm so excited for this. I want to see how their rooting is. I want to see how their bodies are. The one that I didn't find was the Mulan inspired one. So I'll still be on the lookout for her. But look at this. Show off the Princess Jasmine and you with Disney Illy Forever. They dropped these secretly. I say secretly because nobody knew that they were going to drop these. And the store that I went to has a mini Disney store in the middle of the toy section. So it's got a Disney store in the Target. It is amazing. And most of their outfits were gone. I only found one that I wanted. The other one I was kind of unsure of because it looked like it had painted on embellishments. It just didn't look that good. So I am so excited for this. So, so excited for this. These are Disney bounding dolls, um, which means they are inspired by Disney bounders. That's what I think. That's what I believe. And it says a surprise inside of the balloon. And it's got a little jacket, a purse. I'm just so excited for this. So excited for this. She was the last one. I was not going to get a second one, but then I was like, these dolls are going to be really hard to find. I might as well get the ones that I want right now because I don't think they're going to be around for a while. I don't think that they're going to be around for that long. I think either maybe they won't sell that well or maybe scalpers are going to start getting them and, you know, making people pay bazillions of dollars for these dolls. Because Canada does not have Target stores. You can get them off the Disney store, but they're more expensive. The fashion packs are more expensive on the Disney store site. So I just have a feeling that scalpers are really going to come for these dolls. They're kind of not on the radar of everyone right now. The, dollar, the doll community is, I almost said Dollar Tree, the doll community is large and in charge. However, it's still a niche. So I don't think that these are on regular scalpers' radars. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, there are toy scalpers out there who will snatch up all the dolls and make a business for themselves where they just hike up the doll prices. So I really wanted to get in on the ground floor with these because I just think they're amazing. I hope they do well. I hope they bring out more of them. This is Snow White. They need to do an Alice in Wonderland one. I would be all over that. I would just be like, awesome possum. I don't think they have a doll stand. I have doll stands, but I plan on actually sitting these on my shelf, like sitting down. So I really, really love her. And MGA, I did not buy, I did not buy the other Rainbow High doll that I wanted because I really wanted these. I really wanted these. And they are beautiful in person. Absolutely beautiful in person. I love the way they did a real photo and it's not a cartoon it's an actual photography on the dolls i love the box i love the side profile of her it's just beautiful so i'm super excited for that i will be opening these up for you guys the only one that i saw that i really really liked was the bell outfit the other outfits were all sold out they were gone they were gone so i love this i love the top i love the pants the boots, the basket, everything. And it has her jewelry and barrettes. And it's just beautiful. Super, super pretty. Love this outfit. Cannot wait. Again, we have the nice... It's all bell inspired. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful with the books and bell. It's just... I just love this. I'm so excited for this. And then one thing that I did not know about... This, I love the Cruella de Vil movie. I'm probably going to put that on while I clean up my room. This is Illy Forever Cruella. That girl in the corner over there? You, my Illy doll? She's going to be dressed in this. It is so cute. It is so amazing. Got the red sunglasses, the red Cruella sneakers. The skirt isn't really that cute. I mean, it's sewn on. It's not real pockets, but it's cute. The thing that I'm I'm living for, though, is the shirt. Is the shirt. It is so cute. I am just loving this. So in here, you see her wearing it. I'm actually going to be 
having oh they don't have her on here who is she they don't have her on here hmm i'm actually going to be having um one of my illy dolls wear this i do have one illy doll that i think is beautiful and i love Teresa's pieces and beyond and i'm just so excited for this express corella in you with disney illy forever do you have your own unique style are you bold in everything you do embrace your personal style while wearing a purple and black graphic t-shirt denim skirt and retro sunglasses oh this is so cute this is so cute corella on the box and then it has her these are all by jack specific so that is awesome i did get one other thing but i thought it was kind of boring um i got some pony beads so i can make bracelets and they look like this these are all the colors kind of hard to see i don't want to tip it because if i tip it the beads might fall out so yeah what an amazing find what an amazing awesome find and do i know where i'm gonna put them no do i care not at all um <laughs> i do have some room on my shelf that i could where i could put them but i am super excited to do some restyles open up all these dolls on camera once i get situated you might see me in different clothes i might put on a different sweater i'm gonna put on some cozy pants I'm gonna put on the movie cruella and i'm gonna put away all of my doll stuff i have like three things to put away so i can do that kind of quickly and yes so excited so i love you guys so so much hit that like button subscribe jump on the friendship bandwagon and i will see you guys in the next one i'm not a huge disney fan but I love these dolls so much. I love their eyes. I love their, oh, I just love them. I just love them. So I will check in with you guys later. Bye.